group of Catholics has a new message tonight in its support of Bishop Robert Fenn as waves of controversy continue to strike the Diocese of Kansas City St. Joseph. They say the message is clear. Not every Catholic is calling for the bishop to resign. Beth Vaughn has the story. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Before Mass began today, prayers were recited outside the Cathedral of the Immaculate Conception in Kansas City. We have to do a lot of prayer in order to get through this. Inside these doors, Bishop Robert Finn prepared to celebrate Pentecost on the heels of major controversy. We just don't think that's true. We don't think it's accurate. We don't think it's fair. Nathan Lewis organized this rally to support the embattled bishop. I think there's a lot of people who didn't like the bishop before and this is kind of uh, an opportunity for them to really vent some frustration and get some things off their chest. I have a strong belief in the Holy Roman Catholic Church and Bishop Fenn is in that apostolic succession and I believe in him. Others are calling for the head of the diocese to resign. Division in the church has been going on for centuries. We've gone through it before. We've succeeded. You know, we've survived it. Division amongst Catholics over how Finn handled the allegations made against two of his priests. Father Sean Radigan was arrested in May for child pornography. Father Michael Tierney was removed for alleged sexual misconduct with minors. It's easy for all of us to look back and say, yeah, maybe we should have done something different. Instead, today was about finding unity. Beth Vaughn, NBC Action News.